In this video, we will cover the Algolia indexing queue for Magento 2. This is a key feature that can make your store faster by improving how Magento communicates with Algolia. We will explain in details what is the indexing queue, when to use it, and how to set it up. Every time we add, update, or delete a product in Magento, the extension will automatically send an operation to Algolia that contains what changed. This way, the products on the store and in the search results stay consistent. However, when many products get updated in a short amount of time, Magento will have to quickly send a lot of operations. Doing that requires some processing power on the server, which in turn might slow down our store. The goal of the indexing queue is to solve that problem. Here is a short explanation of how it works once it's enabled with the default settings. When a product is added, updated, or deleted in Magento, an operation is added to the indexing queue. The queue will then group up to 100 operations together into a single job. And every 5 minutes, 10 jobs will be sent to Algolia's servers. This means that Magento will send operations in small batches instead of sending everything at once. It will have a positive impact on the store performance. Keep in mind that all the numbers we just mentioned 100 operations, 10 jobs, and 5 minutes can all be easily changed. All stores should enable the indexing queue, but it becomes especially important if you have thousands of products or if you are using a third-party extension that manages your catalog. Because in both cases, Magento will have to send a lot of operations to Algolia over short periods of time. To enable the indexing queue, we have to follow two steps. The first one is done in the Magento admin. Navigate to Stores, Configuration, Algolia Search, Indexing Queue. Set Enable Indexing Queue to Yes, save the configuration, and clear the cache by going to System, Cache Management, there selecting Configuration and Page, and clicking on the Submit button. The second step requires a little programming. All the code that will be shown here can be found in the video description or directly in the documentation. Open a terminal and move to your Magento directory. Type this line. You need to replace this with your own username. Press Enter to see all the existing crowns. Add this new crown to the list. Don't forget to replace this part with the actual path to your Magento directory. This cron will take care of running the queue every 5 minutes. And save the file. To make sure that the indexing queue is working, it's a good idea to re-index all our catalog to fill the queue. We can do so by typing this line in a terminal. Next, reopen the Magento admin and click on Stores, Indexing Queue. Here we see that the queue is ready and that there are currently many jobs in it. If we refresh the page a few minutes later, the number of remaining jobs has decreased. Everything is working well. After some time, suggestions will appear on this page to help you optimize the settings of the indexing queue. In this video, we've learned how the indexing queue can improve the performances of your store and how to enable it. In the following video, we will walk you through all the other notable features that the Algolia extension offers, like analytics, merchandising, synonyms, and more.